Hey team, welcome back. FE Review Problem Statics. We've got a crazy loaded beam. The beam is pinned at one end, supported by a cable that goes from B to C, has a distributed load on it, plus a concentrated load. And we need to find the tension in cable BC. Can you do it? There's your possible choices. Solve it when you come back. Press pause when you come back. I'm going to solve it for you. Let's see if we get the same answer. Ray, set, go. Okay. Did you solve it? Let's go. Okay. So here's what we got. Okay. We've got a beam. Again, it's pin connected at this end. A Y, A X. What's it got on it? It's got 80 down here. Okay. It's got T here. Now this is 30 degrees, isn't it? Well, if that's 60, then that has to be 30, doesn't it? So this guy has two components, and this one right here is T times the sine of 30. Okay, that one's T cos 30, but I don't think I need him, but anyway. Okay, so next we gotta go over here, we gotta get this concentrated load and divide it up into parts. So we've got a rectangular load, which is 30 times 10. How big is that? 30 times 10, 300. Okay. And that is a rectangle, so that's applied right in the middle. And then we got this. If this is 30 and that's 100, this must be 70. And so 70 times 10 is 700 divided by 2. That makes him 350, doesn't he? A cool 350. Or 350, as the kids say. Okay. <laughs> And that's applied at two-thirds of the 10, isn't it? Okay. Well, we're looking for the tension. Gosh, I think we just write the moment equation about A. And we are home free. So minus 300 times 5, because it's in the middle, minus 350 times two-thirds of 10, whatever that is, and then uh, minus 80 times 10 away, and then the T rotates me the other way, so plus T sine 30, also 10 away. Let's go, team. 1,500, uh, 800. I got no idea what that is. Let's calculate it, okay? Anytime you can save yourself time in the calculator, because it's a time test, do it. Like, that's 3,500, right, times 2 is uh, 7,000 divided by 3, right? 7,000 divided by 3. That's faster, right? 23, 33.33 plus 800 plus 1,500 equals 46.33 divided by 10 equals divided by the sine of 30 divided by sine of 30 equals, bam, 926.666 killer newtons. That's how big T is. Okay. What'd you get? What'd you get? Is it over there? There it is. Answer D. All right. Hope that helps. Let's do another one.